Welcome everyone to another Digital Manufacturing Insight Talk. My name is Heiko Weber, Head of Digital Manufacturing Business Area at Motorworks. I'm here together with the Senior Manager Application, Mr. Jens Romberg, at the European Headquarter for Kuma in Krefeld. Hi Jens. Hi Heiko. I'm very pleased about the opportunity today to share our perspectives on our recent collaboration. In focus, we had the Motorworks Milton strategies, especially the features of rotary machining. As innovators, we found shared interest of proving the concepts as well to optimize the strategies with the machine. For more than a century, Okuma has been pursuing excellence in machine tools by cultivating mastership uh, skills and innovating technologies that break new ground. Jens, could you share some insights as a machine tool provider about the Milton strategies? Up to now, in many cases, turn milling did not get the attention it should deserve. Many components, for example, extruder and warm and pump warms, can or um, cam and crankshafts can be efficiently machined by turn milling strategies. Thanks, Jens, for your view of the market challenges. We observed that customers are key responsible to set up the machine and tools correctly for successful application and maintain competitiveness. Which challenges for your customers do you see to apply the cutting process? Well, machines and tools today offer a wide range of possibilities. The process engineer needs powerful programming support to convert his ideas and visions into NC code that uh, our machine tools finally can execute. The more possibilities you have and the more solutions you need to compare, the more decisions are required to finally find the best process. And the CAM module, of course, should not be a limiting factor in this regard. Absolutely. Yeah, well, that's a very valuable aspect of this. Looking to these challenges, machine tool is a, a big factor to utilize the level of expected performance. How do you see the strengths of the Okuma portfolio and where do you see your responsibility to support your customers? Most customers today want to take a finished part from the machine. So they try to machine everything in one setup in one go if possible. Shortening the process chain, reducing the number of setups, and the related lead time, of course, and increasing the flexibility are the key points for investments at customer side. These requirements Okuma fulfills with our flexible, dynamic, multitasking, horizontal and vertical machines with highest accuracies that achieve the final quality that the customer expects to maybe skip the grinding or other cycle. Um, clever, powerful controllers that are easily to integrate into the company network and to connect to CAM systems. And uh, finally, accurate process monitoring and process simulation so that you always have control about the quality you manufacture. But the machine, of course, is only one link in this chain. The full benefit you only get when all elements in your chain are strong and uh, everything works seamlessly together. Well, that sounds like the motivation to our collaboration here to find new innovations for the manufacturing industry. Do you agree? Yes. Understanding and expanding the, lim the limits of each single element in the process chain is the basis for real improvement. In close collaboration, every member helps to optimize the single steps in the process chain with his specific know-how. The new ModulWorks rotary machining package is a good example in this regard. It combines classical turn cut strategies with strategies and tooling from the gear cutting and the die and mold feed. Yeah, well, that's actually a very nice wrap up of the talk. Um, thanks so much for your time, Jens. It's very encouraging for me to see the fruits of our collaboration. I'm very happy that we can find the time and there's only one remaining thing for me to, to say. Thank you, Jens. Oh, thank you, Heiko. Thank you, people, for watching. I hope we can find and share some interesting uh, things for you. I'm thankful for your interest, so stay tuned and make sure you check out the other videos around the Milton topic. Bye for now. See you then.